really strong. I mean, look at that. It's not falling. So I got two things in the mail today. I got myself a new iPhone 13 and I've got this thing right here. This is an iPhone battery pack. It's a MagSafe battery pack. So what does that even mean? It means you can stick it on the back of your iPhone and charge your iPhone. Let's have a quick look. Let's open it up and just show you. Hey, why don't you let me know in the comments what iPhone you've got and what iPhone you're looking at getting this thing to work with. Hey, my name is Emilio. I work in tech and in this channel, we talk about all things tech, including a lot of stuff on the iPhone phone and other things. So do remember to click on the subscription button on the bell so that you don't miss out on any future video releases. Now, if you've seen there's uh, battery packs all around, right? You can get battery packs where you can just plug in a USB port on the back of a battery pack. Here's one that I've got and then I use all the time and I just plug a USB port on one end and then on the other end is what I plug into my lightning port on the back of my iPhone. And that is really great, but that does require cables. And of course the annoyance about cables is that you lose cables and you have to plug this battery pack separately on your iPhone and take it with you everywhere you go. On the back of a lot of these newer iPhones, there's actually a magnet where you can attach this battery pack and essentially you just lock it onto the back and it starts to charge your iPhone without any cables whatsoever. There it is. Beautiful Apple logo on the back. And then on the front, we've got a nice little circle area which will match up perfectly with the back of your iPhone. Now, because this is a battery, you're gonna have to charge it eventually once it runs down. So you got yourself your standard lightning cable to USB on the other end that comes with most iPhones. Plug that in, plug that into a USB charger or into your laptop or desktop computer to actually charge the actual battery. To the left of that, you've got a small little LED indicator light letting you know that the unit is charging. And then you just bring them together. Easy, look at that. What's really nice about this is if I put it up a little bit too high, you actually feel that it's not right and you just click it down. And that's actually quite sturdy. That's not really moving anywhere. And on the front, it says that the iPhone can charge to approximately 90% while using a MagSafe battery. So even if you run all your iPhone all the way down, plug that battery pack in and you can charge it all the way up to 90%. If I put it upside down, you can sort of feel that the magnet is trying to attach to it, but it's not gonna work very, very well. If I put it on the side, same deal. But I'm actually pleasantly surprised just how strong this actually is. Like literally, it's really strong. I mean, look at that. It's not falling. It's not falling. I've literally got to pry it off. Man, it's quite hard. And with a typical Apple design, uh, the little Apple logo matches up perfectly with the Apple logo that's underneath on the phone. And even with a case applied, it still does work. However, it's a lot easier to come off. And really the thicker the case, the more problems you're gonna have, but it is still gonna charge it. So MagSafe charger, should you get one? Sure, why not? It's great, it's a nice little portable device. It will of course be only for the iPhone. Hey, let me know in the comments what iPhone you've got. Let me know whether you wanna get one or not. Maybe it's too expensive, maybe it's pointless, maybe it's useless. Let me know, and as I said before, do subscribe. Release videos all the time, so stay up to date by clicking on the button on the bell. And uh, that's it, like, really appreciate you spending the time. Thank you so much, we'll talk to you next time.